Okay, let's uh, take a look at a lab, uh, the first lab and module four. This is going to be working with tuples. So, let's say I create an application as a two-dimensional tuple. And basically we're looking at a table of values. What I want to do is I want to hold this data. So there will be three elements to each row of data. When you're done, I want to be able to print out something that looks kind of like this. It doesn't have to be exact, but see if you can print out that value. Now, remember that a loop, a for loop, will actually help you do this. You just have to pull out a row and then print it out. Um, after that, see if you can change the way it prints out so it prints it out kind of like this, where it's stacked. What we're doing is messing with the formatting. I recommend you go ahead and, and use some pseudocode and um, just go ahead and let's say you have a tuple, whatever your tuple name is that you came up with. Uh, just go ahead and use a print statement to print it all out just to see what it looks like um, by default with the print statement. And then we're just going to modify it so we can have a custom printout. Hopefully that makes some kind of sense. You're going to take this data and come up with a custom printout. In fact, I'll tell you what, I'm just going to go ahead and cheat a little bit. I bet you'll like this too. I'm going to copy that data. I'm going to come over here and I am going to right click and say new Python file and I'll call it uh, lab 04-81. I'm going to paste that code in there so I don't have to type it out. Now remember when you do this kind of stuff you have to be careful. Python or Word may be trying to help you way too much. I'm not sure if I saved much time with that or not, but I don't know. I, I like not having to type things. You may too. Now I can go through and I'm to put some commas there and so on. So that hopefully will give you a little start on there. I'll let you guys work on it for a bit and I'll come back with an answer. See you in the next video.